Merseyships focuses its services on uh, Western Central Africa right now. The surgical services are targeted at the, the people that either don't have access to it or can't afford those surgeries any other way. So that's the surgery they need might not be provided in the country or it might just be too expensive and they, they can't afford it. I heard about it because I was living near where this ship was being built in Newcastle and I kept bumping into other crew members and it got my attention and it sounded like something that I might like to come and do. So on the ship we have the service delivery team and we're responsible for all the usual kinds of things that you might expect for desktops, laptops, monitors, phones, um, the network, um, internet access. The ship would not be able to function in the same way if it didn't have this team on board. The ship is like a small town and the medical and program personnel are about half of the crew but the remaining half is a mixture of everything from IT staff to we have a post office, we have a shop, we have a school, we have a hair salon, there's a bank. We manage hospital related things but we are a ship so we have to manage marine related issues. Uh, there's quite a lot of different types of systems that we have to provide the support for and that's been enjoyable and a, and a challenge, a rewarding challenge. It's great to be so close to the end result of this ministry and be able to see patients waiting outside on the dock for their surgeries, see them come up the gangway, see them in the hospital if we have to go down there to work on computers and systems down there. You have a sense of being part of something that's bigger than yourself and that you're part of a, a large group of people all trying to see achieve the same end result and that's been a great thing to be part of and so I'd encourage anybody to come and give it a try. It's just a great experience.